It's easy to miss driving down Nanny Helen Burroughs Avenue in Northeast. But this library kiosk, which has seen better days, brings up fond memories for locals here in Deanwood. I would like to see the kiosk brought back to life as it was because there's still a lot of kids in this community. At 120 square feet, the kiosk served as Deanwood's only library from 1976 until 2008. According to DC Public Library Archives, it was one of three library kiosks built in largely African-American communities east of the river. And during that time in the 1970s, only libraries that were built or existed were west of the river, the Carnegie libraries, you know, these grand big libraries. Um, and so we got this kiosk. The one room library contained just a few thousand books, one librarian, no computer, and this sign that's still posted on the wall. DC Public Library's vision of equitable access to information. The kiosk has been an eyesore since a car crash last year, but when neighbors got wind of the city's plan to remove the kiosk, they renewed their efforts to take back the space, launching this petition to stop the demolition. This whole area of Deanwood is historic. Alicia Rucker and Tin Vin Wen are with the Friends of Deanwood Library. The ladies are not only advocating to reclaim the kiosk that is a featured stop on the Deanwood Heritage Trail, but they're demanding a standalone library. That's 20,000 square feet. Um, the one that we have connected to the rec center is about 7,000 feet. That current library at the rec center was opened in 2010, two years after the kiosk closed. We want to creatively reimagine and reuse this space to honor and preserve its history. This history of such stark inequality, yet, you know, a space that was um, such a warm and lovely community space for the, for, for the neighborhood. So I've been in touch with the folks over in Deanwood. I just got word from one of their ANC commissioners that the demolition has been postponed for now. A spokesperson with DC Library says a full service standalone library in Deanwood is part of their master plan for the next 10 years.